today is my birthday in real life. <laughs> uh, so I think this is like 10 days ahead. I uh, just had the best lunch ever with Jocelyn and now I'm at Bedford, Ant uh, Bedford Street Antiques, excuse me, <laughs> very, very laid back today. Uh, I wasn't going to go out, but it's so nice out and she asked if I wanted to get lunch and I'm in desperate need of stuff for the pottery train that unfortunately has already passed by the time this video is posted. Um, I will say yes to anything the thrifting twins ask me. So hopefully I find some stuff for that. I'm also looking for stuff for my weekly variety sales on whatnot and Christmas is right around the corner. So let's go in and see what we can find. See, this has like a tiny little nick on it. This thing is so freaking cool though. A lot going on over here, as I like to say. The weird double-faced doll. The lighting is really doing something. I don't know which way to look first. These are really pretty, these Sherbert. Like the pattern, super cute. 18, 20% off. It's for all. Super into this. 35. Love that green. I'm super into that color orange too. I think that's Viking glass. I could be mistaken. And I love that pink swirly thing. Gosh, this vendor always has the most unique stuff. Look at all their fun Halloween. I love that <laughs> jack-o'-lantern die cut. It is so cool. It's got like crazy face on it. I have to know, how much is it, 22? What about this one? That one's got like a bloody tooth. <laughs> 19, wait, does that say 22? Maybe it says 19. Hmm, this one's amazing with the black cat and the moon. 25, so fabulous. I've been like really into the black cat situation. Look at those amazing Bakelite bangles. Oh, so cool. Those geometric ones with the polka dots are definitely my favorite. So there's like a lot of little elves and stuff. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Five poodles, 28. 10, 15, 20, 25. I think I'm gonna have to grab that. Five for 28, that's not bad. Um, the other thing that is interesting to me, oh my gosh, look at the Miller Studio Chakra Fish in the original thing. They have all these little elves is what I'm trying to get out. They're all about what I would get for them after fees. However, these ones stick out for sure. They're not in the best condition, but they're definitely harder to find. Oh, I just turned around and noticed that this entire booth is brand new. They're like hobbyist versions of desirable elves. I think that's a little kittle. I could be wrong. Um, I don't know much about little kittles other than they sell. Look at the little red riding hood vinyl doll. That's so cute. Uh-oh, what do we have here? Oh, wow. I love these. I'm having a Christmas ephemera sale. I wonder if they're all as fabulous as this one or if that one's just kind of funky. Hey, look. The Deets lamp. It's only five bucks. That's really good. Oh, my gosh. There's actually all kinds of stuff. Miss Know-It-All Ponytail Dictionary. I'm sorry. I'm probably making everybody dizzy right now. 14. That's not bad. Those things are getting harder and harder to find. Look at this fabulous bear. It's not rushed in, but it's still cute. This rubber chick is kind of calling my name. $5 sold. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ponytail Little Miss Traveler, $10. How busted is it? It's got the damage pretty bad on the top. That is so great though. And then I see this little Polish doll, 14. That's a good, oh no, she's stuck. Uh-oh, ah, yeah, that's not a bad price. It's more than I'd like to pay for it. I'm trying to put her back properly. I'm so dang short. 
Okay, here's another interesting one. Look at this toy drum. I'm like weirdly into this. It's got raccoon tails on it. I'm doing a very poor job at showing this off. 15, 1950s Canada drum. It's very cool. Oh my gosh. Love him. <laughs> I like really love him. This dog is pretty great too, but this one, I'm like, oh, he's so, his face is everything. <gasps> Look at you. $4 sold. So I am really tempted to pick up this drum just because it's kind of different, honestly. Oh, I don't know what's attracting to me. Uh, so much, but I don't think I could get much more out of that at 15. I kind of glanced over this snack plate, but then I looked again and I saw the imagery on it. That's pretty amazing. Pottery. Well, that's pottery. That's really kitschy, too. The little swimmers. I kind of love that. Wish it was complete. I'm not sure. Look at this, this is such a fun graphic too. And then what's going on with the Santas down here? 20, what a fun candy tin. 28 firm. Howdy doody hat, gosh, this booth is awesome. The prices are super fair too. This guy's contemporary, but I kind of love him. It looks like he's probably the top to something. <laughs> I really like this. This is quite different too. Very interesting. What is happening here? Oh, it's a car. Gosh, I can't believe these things are still here. It's so hard to watch them sit here. Especially this one. I feel like... If I, was, if I was buying this for myself, I would not think twice at 17. I think I might even be able to make a couple bucks off of it at 17. These are kind of hard to find. Now, that one's newer than the last one we saw because it's got the green in it. 15. Oh, it's just so great. I wish this booth had like a little extra discount. Just <laughs> not that their prices aren't fair, but just for how cheap I am. What's that over here? Oh my gosh. Look at these sick little chenille bunnies. They're so fun. Is this a sewing box? Dude, what is happening here? This thing is so cool. What? How amazing is that? Look at the handles on the side. It's very heavy. $79. You know what? No, I don't blame it. And then what is this, a photo album? That's so cool. This is really pretty too. 22. Is this a cat? We have a witch. These look new, just kidding. Oh, look at these guys, how sweet. My cord. That's a really good price, I should probably pick that up. But, I'm being being a little weird today. I get to be because it's my birthday and I don't feel like messing with that today. Now I have to remember to keep my eye out for pottery. Pottery really isn't my thing, although I will say I've gotten I kind of like that vase. I've gotten pretty uh, lucky recently. Like a lot of this stuff I picked up. I'm like, oh, I don't know what this is and I'm not going to Google it. I'm just going to buy it and it's been something special. This is really heavy though. That's one thing that kind of turns me off. I don't want a buyer to have to pay more than the cost of the item to ship it. Of course, I can see the price tags on all the other ones, but I can see the price tag on that elf with the drummer head. That is fantastic. That one's at nine, that's not bad at all. The other ones are pretty close. They're at like 14 and 18. I think I might. I think I might ask to get in some cases. I was kind of trying to avoid that, but. Dude, look at this crazy cool snail egg. Wait, the giraffe. Vintage 
giraffe. What? That thing is amazing. Dude. Yeah, I really love this giraffe. It's at $24. I think I can make a couple bucks off of it. It's definitely more than I'd like to spend up front. But I think I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna go upstairs and... And then if I have time again, do cases. Or if I feel like it, I'd think, I should say. So this thing is so cool. She would be kind of great for the um, pottery train. It's a little more than I'd like to spend. Oh my gosh, look at this fantastic Santa head. How much are you? 19. Oh, I love him. Nailed it. One of these things are not the same. Awesome. For $10... I do believe I'll be taking these. Perfect for the poodle cell, just in time. I also really like this little jadeite nesting bunny. What else do I have in here? The little cucumber thingies. <laughs> cucumber heads, 10 bucks. That's not bad at all, I've had those before. This guy's kind of great. Small, oh, as is, that's got a chip. I forgot I looked at that last time. The little shelf sitters. Those are kind of cute, or plant sitters, I should, uh, should say. What is this? That's kind of fun. Hmm. I'm still picky, I'm not desperate. I've seen a bunch of stuff that would work for the pottery train. These are so great, but I'm being picky. Cause I kind of feel like I'd rather be picky and just end up selling like cat stuff than just get stuff that's not really my thing. I did get one thing that's not my thing. I got this uh, Eldrith cro croc, but it's kind of fun to switch it up sometimes. This is kind of fun. That's $10. I'm not sure how well that would do for me. I'm really into this little vase too, but it's new and that looks like it's pretty in there, honestly. Let's see. What else did I got? This is a fun booth. And I already checked the price on this. This one's 19. I'm not gonna lie. If it was a little bit less, I would totally do it. I'd love the shape of that. Man, oh nine. Even though it's newer. What about this? This is cool. Wait. Five. Oh! Oh my gosh, that would have been a nightmare. No, that's not the same thing. We don't want that. Yeah, that is really cool. Name your poison. Tilso. That's neat. Hmm, it's missing its original top, though. Which makes me not really want to invest 15 in it. This is cool, isn't it? Now this I'm kind of into. Is that a crack, though? It's got a weird line. I like that it's got its original... Sticker, that's really neat. Uh, I'm a little nervous about that though. Here's another poodle. 18. A little opalescent hobnail. Ooh, that's quite pretty for six dollars. Yeah, for six bucks, I'll take that. Look at this crazy thing. That's really interesting, isn't it? Wish there was more than one. Still, it's kind of crazy. Not my thing, but I kind of feel like for seven bucks, I'm gonna feel real stupid when I watch, um, when I watch the comments, somebody tell me that this is like some, like, <laughs> brand new, generic thing. I'm just kind of into it. I'm gonna get it. It's the color and the shape. That's what's really doing it for me now. If I could only find. Some more stuff that I'm actually looking for, and that would be great. Look at this crazy thing. Frog and fly. That's kind of fantastic. I love this. <laughs> um, ooh. I also have to be thinking about the train to Trippyville. I just got a message about it. I completely forgot. I kind of stopped filling my spots. I was doing well for a while, and then I got sidetracked by the pottery. This looks new, yeah. Dang, look at this mirror. That is gorgeous. But also this, this is amazing. I love the metal flowers. I've never seen it in a toad thing like that. 
you know what? It's a vomit cat. Oh my gosh. I kind of have to get this. I feel bad because I feel like Jocelyn's going to want it. <laughs> but it's a cat. Oh, it's so her. I'll give her first dibs. Um, I'm going to text her right now. Gosh. Oh, this is so cool. I feel like I'm safe at 20 bucks. I'm going to grab it. These are really hard to find and it's in really good condition. All right. Now, what about this face? This is an awesome one. 18. I love the color. Hmm. I still am not finding what I'm actually looking for. I found like everything but 18. Oh my gosh. Look at this thing. $4 sold. That thing is incredible. <laughs> now this is gorgeous. $8. I am gonna go ahead and get that. I really like the color and the shape on that. It's a little weirdly ionic, but I can get behind that at eight bu for eight bucks. What about this? Ah, it's probably expensive. It's definitely hard to get my hands on. I think it says 58. Look at this guy. <laughs> oh my gosh, how great is he? $2. He's definitely not perfect, but he's kind of spectacular. Wait a minute, what does this say? Amber glass fairy light. Why is it ten dollars? I don't understand why it's ten dollars. And the green one's eighteen. Why is this only ten bucks? I don't know much about it. I kind of feel like that's cheap though. I feel like I'd do well on that. All right, so it is a good deal. The stars and bars just isn't really the best selling, and honestly. I feel weird leaving that for that cheap, but eh, just there's a lot of them on the market right now, so kind of bored by it. These are cool. I got excited for a second because I never find stuff like that at cheap prices. <laughs> What's this Santa? He's fabulous. You know what though? At second look, I kind of want to get this green one. Oh, it's got that candle. Let's see. Do I want? Is that gonna be? Excuse me. Is that gonna be a? to get out. Look at this crazy troll. How much does this sell? 20 bucks. Yeah, those have really gone up in price. Well, this has my interest. What is happening here? Look at this thing. $3 Santa doll. Oh, good grief. He's attached to everything. He's hilarious. I love him. You know what else I love? I love this little elf ornament. At eight dollars and fifty cents, he's pretty fantastic. I think I'm gonna grab that. Speaking of ornaments, look at this funny guy. I love him, and he's only a buck. Good grief! Look at all this Christmas. This one is six dollars as is. I love him. Uh, what about this Santa? This is an older one. A lot of this stuff is contemporary. Twenty-five. That's about retail. Ah, poodle bottle. It's so fabulous. Oh, I really want to justify spending $19 on that. And the owl. Man, how much is this owl pull mold? That's so epic. Well, this has my attention. Look at these fox salt and pepper shakers. How fantastic. $10. I've never seen them before. I will take those. Those are really different. And, of course, the feet. Those are only 6 bucks. They have a little bit of where i bet i could clean those up they're so fun i'll take them for like maybe, maybe i'll throw them in trippyville good grief speaking of trippyville look at that weird doll well i spent 104 dollars in there i didn't get any pottery but i sure had a good time i decided to uh let the cases go do it another day just enjoy having a low stress key free day and i will see you guys tomorrow at 10 a.m